Hey everyone, welcome to From the Depths. I'm Minty and this is episode 12 of the Cruiser Clash League tournament thing. Um, in this episode we've got the Stonewall Fortress by Cashin facing off against the Phoenix Point Defense Fleet by uh, by Cool J, correct? Let me double check. Yes, why do I always forget that one? That is the one that I always forget. I apologize for that. Anyway, these ships, every ship in fact, Whoops, my hand kind of... I was, I'm gesticulating with my hand and gesturing and stuff even though you can't see it and I bumped the mouse. Again, apologies for that. Uh, if you want to see more in-depth views of these craft, their weapons, armory, etc., uh, the playlist that links to the overview video of every ship in this tournament is linked in the description. But for now, we're just going to get right down to the death and destruction and see if the, uh, the Stonewall Fortress can pull out its first win here or if the Phoenix Point Defense Fleet is going to collect another good chunk of points. Uh, it does not seem that the Stonewall Fortress is smoked, so those laser-guided missiles are coming straight in, and those are going to hurt. Oh, yes, we, we've seen the Flotilla of Pain's damage output. It just, it, look at that, it's drilling mi holes straight through the Flotilla, or through the Stonewall Fortress. That missile strike alone was enough to bring it down at 85%, and it didn't even hit the cannons. Ouch! That is painful. I guess that's why it's called the Flotilla of Pain. Oh! Friendly fire! Friendly fire! Oh, it just set off its own cannon! Oh, that, that dang, uh... Failsafe not detecting other turrets, or it just completely lacks a failsafe. One of the two... Those laser-guided missiles, man. It's like the Stonewall Fo Fortress really needed some smoke. That's a shame. And here comes the Flotilla of Pain's second barrage. And oh, that's it. Kaboom. It's gone. That's it. It is dead. It is despawning. Absolutely torn apart by the Phoenix Point Defense Fleet. Very quick, very short battle. So we will get it restarted, get it reset, get round two under the way. Under the way, yes. Instead of just underway, under the way. Clearly. That, that, that is the better version. Okay, so Phoenix Point Defense Fleet, you are a broadside spawn, so you will spawn in first, since the pausing makes it so that first spawn really does not matter anymore. Uh, since I'm able to just pause this, it doesn't make a difference. We got the Stonewall Fortress facing toward. Load it in. Timer reset. Mm, let's see how this one goes. I, I imagine it's going to go much the same since the Stonewall Fortress doesn't have anything to stop that massive barrage of missiles from the Flotilla of Pain. And its own missiles seem to be getting stopped by the, uh, the f by flares. And here it comes. Here comes the pain for the aptly named float from the aptly named flotilla. But they do seem to be doing a little bit oh less. But uh, there's still more coming. So here we go down to 89 percent again. And it does not look like the uh, well the phoenix is taking some damage to cannons, but not enough. It is managing to kite the the Stonewall Fortress's shots seems like the AI on this cannon here may have been damaged and it is unable to fire on it anything it's just sitting there and then here comes the second barrage which uh, in the first battle proved to be fatal oh looks like an Amorak explosion may have happened here yeah there's not much left in the center there if there was anything there I, I'm not sure I don't remember exactly Oh, there goes one of the cannons. Kaboom. And with that, yeah, that's it. The Stonewall Fortress is AI dead. And probably too damaged as well. It was absolutely wrecked by the Phoenix Point Defense Fleet. Should be despawning any moment. Yep, there it is. That's it. So congratulations to Cool J. You will be earning another six points for your victory here. And unfortunately, the Stonewall Fortress will be once again earning two points for its defeat. But hey, it's better than a draw, right? Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you out on the battlefield.